welcome back to the New York Jets franchise. It is week 14, and I have some seriously important things to talk about. Let's start out with a little season overview. One quick reminder for everybody who is just tuning in, we simmed the first eight games of the season so that everybody would have a four and four record and that we could get to the playoffs quicker. My goal is to have faster seasons. I hate that Madden does not give you the customization option to play, let's say an eight game season or a 10 game season, but this is EA after all. Now in all the user controlled games I have won so far, so I'm four and zero on those games, except last week, week 13 against the Minnesota Vikings and the middle of the game my opponent disconnected however I was up 11 with the football in the third quarter so we thought it was fair to give me the force win there's one problem with giving me the force win though I had a breakout for Julian Blackman who has been an absolute superstar on this roster and there was no way for me to force Julian Blackman the upgrade so we just fair simmed it so the first thing I want to do before doing everything we usually do in franchise is I want to go look at Julian Blackman now Julian Blackman previously was a 78 overall star so if he got the upgrade he's gonna be a superstar so I'm on the roster there's Lamar well, you can see the Jets roster just like this. Anybody who's just now tuning in. Lamar Jackson, Debo Samuel, Najee Harris, Trent Brown, Dalton Schultz, Ed Oliver, Aiden Hutchinson, who is now an 83 overall, Kyle Hamilton, Jack Conklin, Bobby Anderson, Frankie Louvu, JC Horn, Isaiah Rogers Sr., Tevin Jenkins, Darius Slayton, Kenneth Murray, Derek Stingley. And the moment of truth is right here. Whether or not he got the breakup. Breakup. Holy shit. Bella, come back. Whether or not he got the breakout, I'll learn in three, two, one. Blackman! Superstar! <laughs> he got it! He actually got it! Oh my god, dude. He actually could be a fucking menace in the league, man. He was not even on my radar, but he's 24. Six foot 187, and now he's got superstar. The only problem is he's actually such a low overall that I can't even put a single ability on him. That's so huge, though, boys. That's awesome. So he's a 78 overall zone free safety. Oh, he has reach elite. Oh, never mind. There are three abilities you can get. I take it back. There's three abilities you can get. Um, bench press, recuperation, reach elite. I guess I'll give him reach elite. Now, in the best case scenario, the best ability that I would want in franchise is acrobat. So if we can get acrobat at 90 overall zone, that would be awesome. Pick artist is always a great ability too. So once we get him to an 85 overall, we get that. And at 80 zone, what do we get access to? At 80 overall zone, the only thing we get access to is flat zone KO, which honestly, he isn't going to do much on him. So to be honest, he's really not going to have good abilities until we get him to 85 overall when we can give him pick artist. And then deep out zone KO at 85 overall zone is also a really, really good ability. So we kind of just got to wait till Julian Blackman gets there. If we ever, dude, it's going to be a long road, but if we get him to a 90 overall, dude, oh, and we can get Acrobat, he'll be a dog. All right. Yep. So that is our roster right now. I'm super excited for this game. So our very first game in this franchise was against the Bills. It was stupid close. I won by three points at the end. Super good opponent. So it should hopefully be another really, really good game today. We'll take a look at the playoff picture. If the season ended right now, here's what the playoffs would look like. The three, I am the three seed. Yikes. I'm undefeated and I'm the three seed, but I did have a bye week. So I don't think some of these other teams have had that yet. Or maybe that doesn't matter. I don't know. But the Chiefs are the one seed right now. The Colts are the two seed. I'm the three seed. So I would take on the Chargers. I haven't played any of these guys yet. I don't think. I don't think I've played any of these guys yet, so. All right, cool. Well, first things first, before we go do some strategy, we got to look at the Bills roster. I know we just played them, but I want to show everybody again, and let's kind of talk about that first game. So, that first game, he ripped a huge run, very first play of the game, 80-yard touchdown with Saquon Barkley. So, that we got to be worried about. Vita Vea has inside stuff. So, Vita Vea locks up the run in the middle. So, he's got a really good one-two punch there. Minka's solid in the skies. I think he has deep out zone KO, some ability like that, because he was knocking my shit down. Then he's got Dak. So, he's honestly just got a really well-rounded, solid team. He's even got Trayvon Walker. Shit. All right. Last time, he tore me up in a lot of different ways. He was passing really well, and he's running the ball really well. So I just do defend short pass, something really simple. And I'm going to try throw it deep, even though I did run the ball pretty effectively last time. So we'll go, we'll go through it deep, and we'll see how that goes. I'll go two passing touchdowns. Let's go 20 points or less, because he put up a lot of points on me last time. 250 offensive, and we will win 
the turnover battle. All right. So Julian Blackman actually had an upgrade. I don't know how I missed that before, but we'll give him the zone. The attribute upgrades don't matter here unless I get something like speed. Tackle zone awareness. Yeah, whatever. At this point, I'm just worried about getting him a good ability. And then Kenneth Murray, I actually want to make sure he gets field general. Because field general is how you get lurker, I believe. Awareness, block shed, man, pursuit, and tackle. And that worked out really well for us, too. I will auto Madison. Dude, I swear, every single franchise I play in, the computer always auto drafts me Alexander Madison. I have no idea why, but. All right, boys, a little rivalry game. Jets versus Bills. An amazing matchup. First time we played. I start with the kickoff, my favorite thing to do. All right, um, did he kick return on me last time? I don't know, but I'm not risking it anymore, man. That shit is so spooky. It's so spooky. Oh, he's got little dudes. Whoever that is looks like he could be pretty fast. Hey, good tackle. So if you guys noticed, the first time I played the Bills, it was this guy named Mr. Weedle. This time it's Go Chains. So in order for this franchise to run efficiently and us get out all the games on time, I always have to have somebody that I'm able to play. So for example, Mr. Weedle was not able to play today. So Goo subbed in. The good thing is Goo is super fucking good. So this is going to be a good game no matter what. Oh, I don't know where the hell my backer's going there. Oh, he's got tank, doesn't he? He's got tank. I have to go low. I made that same mistake last game. Does he have tank? Does he have tank on? Oh, yeah. It's tank and running back apprentice. That's such a nice combo. He'll go play action again. He's going to throw underneath. Nice throw. And I whiffed. Wait a minute. I whiffed with everybody. I got to stop trying to do big hits. I don't have crusher. This isn't mutt. I don't have crusher or enforcer. I don't think it's worth it. I'm going to go on Julian Blackman here because I think this is a run. Oh, it's play action again. He could go halfback. Ooh, honestly, with, with what was available, that was a bit sketchy. All right, we're going we're gonna to send a blitz and guess pass. I got the middle. Ooh, nice pass. Goo, good hit. Oh, that was right on the ball. It's always some weird trial period. They always fuck it up too. Oh, that whip is so open. Can we get this tackle? We can. Good hit, stick tackle, but he does not have far to go. All right, I'm going to run commit. I just feel like one yard. That's so lame. Dude, to, to load up the box and run commit and he walks it in, that's so lame. All right, first and 10. Let's see what he starts out in. Mm, be patient. Be patient. Oh, shit. Little too patient there. I think I got to get Debo involved early. God, how am I going to climb out of this? I'll take those yards. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, what? Yo, I got LASIK. It's working in the reverse order. I apologize, boys. I'm really struggling. I'm going to go five wide. I kind of want to hit Darius Slayton. I feel like that's... Okay, I can take this. Get as much as I can with Debo. I'll go for it. Fourth and eight. Shit. I think he's going to switch to man coverage here. He does. I still think I can hit Debo. Fourth and eight. Oof. I don't know why me switching the... The sides of that play messed his defense up, but it worked out in our favor. Oh, he was in a Tampa 2. Dude, I didn't even lock the fuck in. I'm playing like shit. I really needed to lock in. All right, first and 10. Let's get it, let's get it figured the fuck out here, boys. Great start. Great start. Najee Harris. But all right. Second and five, down seven. Ball at half. Do I think Najee is too slow? No, I love Najee. I don't care about speed. I like power backs. I'm not gonna like outrun people to the edge anyway. That's not really how I play. Like, that's fucking single back right at your ass. Right in your dick. And look at that. Najee's fast. Woo! What a run. Dude, what perfect timing. What perfect timing for someone to say Najee's too slow. Hey, you know, I got a lot of that shit. When I drafted Najee, all of chat was like, bro, concrete shoes. He can't run. He can't run. Fuck it, Najee. Najee said, fuck you. I can run. I would love to get running back apprentice on Najee eventually. That'd be so nice to have. I gotta remember I have Lamar Jackson. And Debo Samuel. He sees Najee. I don't think he can get there. Oh, what? Yo, dashing Deadeye. Dashing Deadeye should act it. Oh, no. I probably wasn't rolling forward enough. Papa, honestly, just get in five wide and take off running with Lamar. As much as I like that, dude, I've gotten too much shit in my comments for doing that. People hate when I do that. So I got to chill out with it a little bit. I think I might be able to hit Debo here on a beautiful route. We've always not in. He's not in. It's first and goal. He knows what I'm doing, but can he stop it? He knows exactly what I'm doing, but can he stop it? Head back quick base. Right up the middle. Dude, that's dumb because that's what I did when he ran the ball, except he fucking walked it in and I just got TFL'd for two. So that's dumb. 
Yo, Weebo with a big catch, but I am not in the end zone yet. I want to try something here. Come on, Minka. You know, Minka, you know you're not fucking making that tackle. The back-to-back -back run plays. Najee's getting it going early. And the Buffalo D-line, despite the Devea, can't stop it right now. I do hate the fact that he has full momentum right now and the, and the score is tied. Like, why, why do you have... Why do you got a whole bar of momentum? It's 7-7. Seven to seven. I just I just did a four-minute great drop. Whatever. What does he get for that momentum factor? I think he gets... It's probably because he's a home team, right? Is that how that works? Ooh, Marquise Goodwin. Wait a minute. Marquise Goodwin is such a good return, man. We got to clog this up. Great work. Great work. All right, first and 10. He's going to go stretch left. I can't get behind him. Hey, Isaiah Rogers. Wait, why is Isaiah Rogers in? Isaiah Rogers is not supposed to be in. All right, whatever. Second and four. I'm not going to guess pass just in case he were to have run that ball. Yeah, that would have been real bad. I don't think he has anything. Hey. Just a little, a little pickup for Epinesa. There's too much to cover here. I shouldn't be in this defense. He's got the whip route. Oh! Hutch! Oh, and he got it. Oh, and he got it. I thought Hutch might have stopped him, like, perfectly. Goo's a dog, though. Ooh! Hutchinson just made a fucking monster TFL. Completely dominated that play by himself. Oh! Hutch! Back to back! Aiden Hutchinson! My first... That's my first man coverage blitz, and I guess pass against play action. It's about the only way you're going to get that good. Ooh, that's crazy. He sends one up. That was a very nice pass. I think he did get the first down. Wow. All right, first and 10. Let's see what he's got. No halfback route. I've got this. Oh, ho, ho, that's so painful. Oh, that's so painful. I'm so close to that. All right, I see Saquon. Whoa, I don't see Saquon. Not well enough. We got to let... I almost should have let him score. I really almost should have let him score because he gets to milk a lot of clock here now. And we didn't want that. Ooh. Ooh, but Aiden Hutchinson with the TFL. If he doesn't get in now, now I'll feel good. All right. Second and goal. Ooh. Stingley can't get there. With 20 seconds on the clock, the Bills score. That's why I wanted... That's why I wanted Saquon to score. Was because I wanted 50 seconds and three timeouts. But I still have three timeouts, 20 seconds. So hopefully I can get in field goal range. Darn it. I need to get that interception with Kenneth Murray. I had to get it that first time. That was my that was my good chance right there. Need some big boy yards here. Yeah. I feel like he probably expects me to go Debo. Like he would guard that. First and 10. Let's find out. That was beautiful. 13 yards, 11 seconds now. I maintain all timeouts. I'm trying to get him moving to that side so that I can throw at Debo. Oh, God. Is he going to fuck? Yep, he's going to fucking... Oh, my God. Oh. As, as soon as that ball went up in the air, you knew somebody was coming down with it. All right, well, he's got two seconds left. No way he's in field goal range. Oh, my God. Yo, that's crazy. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, that sucks. All right, well, I do get ball here. I do get ball here, so we got to go score. It's not an objectively bad throw. That shit's just... You're right. I should have predicted that, you guys. My bad. Because NCAA football comes out before that. I'm not sure what that backer was doing right there, but he was doing something weird. There's a guy that stepped up like he was going to blitz, and then he kind of just gave up on it. All right, not a bad pickup right there. He's kind of sitting in cover four, so I'm hoping he continues that. Mm, that's not exactly what I wanted, but it worked out. Najee, good play. Yeah, so this is going to be big right here. Got to score here and then got to get a stop, so... You're kidding me. 78, who the fuck are you blocking? You didn't block anybody. Look at that. He walked through the... <laughs> It's not my game, boys. All right. We're going to have to figure it out, though. We're going to have to figure it out. All right. Let's see what we can do here. I'm just going to take the yards I can get. Second and 17. Third and 12. Third and 12. Third and 12. 
A little sketchy. I had the underneath throw. Didn't take it. I actually think I know what I can hit here. Yep. Ooh. Fourth and five. Big pickup. I didn't have time to think about it. Come on, Jets. Got to pull it together here. This is a tough one right now. Buffalo. Buffalo's giving it to me. That's just too open not to throw. Ward. Ooh. Najee. Eight for 11. We got to keep up the pace. Got to keep up the tempo. That's main coverage. 100% sure that's main coverage. He might have just switched out of it. It is still main coverage. Great move, Darius Slayton. Six yards, we'll take it. I'm staying no huddle. I think it's still man coverage. Might now be zone. He is stuck on a D tackle. That is the greatest thing. And damn it, pocket is collapsing. I think I had a throw though that I missed. I'm not entirely sure. Third and six. I wouldn't even hate the field goal here, but I also wouldn't prefer it. I'm gonna look at Shaheen. Shaheen Chevrolet over there. Got him. That's too easy. Dude, dude, you know what you forget about Robbie Anderson? Robbie, Robbie Anderson's got that 96 speed, but he's tall. He's a big boy. I'm going to look at this. I'm going to look at this handoff. I'm going to evaluate it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nashi! I think he guessed pass there because Nashi bounced off that like it was nothing. Hey, great bounce back drive. Great bounce back drive. Down by three, his ball. And that still, dude, that took me four minutes and 40 seconds, and I was in no huddle. This shit was not easy. I just got to keep switching between man and zone. I can't, I can't be too one-dimensional here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I can't move. I can't move. Now I can move. Thank God. <laughs> that was sketchy. That was a spooky throw. All right. Third quarter in the books. I got to force a field goal here because if he scores a touchdown, it's going to be really tough for me to win. Probably a stretch left. Oh, stretch right. Who's there? Who's there? Kenneth Murray's there. Hutch is there, I think. Trying to claw back. Down three. And he's got the ball. So it's it's all pretty tough. But I got to try and make something happen. First and 10. Definitely could be a stretch. Definitely could be a stretch. Ooh. I don't know how you got so open. Say quads. Wide opens. 12 for 12. Look at Dak, bro. All right, I'm going to switch this up a little bit. I think this is an inside zone. I'm going to blow it up. Ooh. <gasps> Kenneth Murray! No way! No way! I'm standing on Dak, and he threw that ball. Oh, that's such a bummer. Damn. All right. We're struggling on defense right now. This is a run. Okay. Play action. Play action. Don't do something stupid now. It has not been my game today, boys, but that's okay. That's okay. We got to keep clawing. Inside zone? Oh, yeah? Where are you going to cut it? Dude, what the fuck is that? Oh, is he have the momentum for better blocks? No, he has improved coverage. Jesus. Dude, this is diabolical. I wonder if he does play action here. No, just a handoff to Saquon. Dude, that's insane. I'm run committing middle. And he's running in the middle. Oh my God. Dude, that's crazy. I don't know what's going on, boys. It's not the Jets. It's not the Jets game. We're getting, we're just getting shit on and everything. Four down linemen, two outside linebackers, a middle linebacker, both corners, and two safeties coming down. And Cinco Barkley just walked over the middle of my line. All right, well, nothing we can do, boys. Got to go down there, try and get a touchdown, and uh, you, we're going to have to score real fast to get this ball back. Just so you know. I'm going to take the easy one. The only problem with that throw is I'm inbounds. Still got a lot more to go, and I think no huddle is going to chunk. Okay, 10 seconds off. Okay, that's not too bad, actually. I thought no huddle was going to take a little more. He knew I was doing that. I'm going to call one timeout right now so that I can hopefully use this two-minute warning on a deep one. I'm in such a tough position here. Mm, deep one press is about the only thing I like right now. Oh, Bobby. Bobby. That's why you call the timeout right there. It's not over. It's looking a lot better right now, but even still, man, he can milk a lot of clock. Fuck. All right, but that's where we got to start. That's where we start. Great throw. Oh, guys, yeah, it's, it's chosen one. My bad. He's chosen. He was chosen to get that right there. Where's the user? Where the fuck is the user? Freaking me out. 
Shit. I saw that there was a pancake down there. I tried to get to it. Second and goal. I don't know what this is. He's there. Got him. All right. Probably just could have done that the first time, but whatever. Dalton Schultz, that might be his first touchdown. We can't, we can't just act like that didn't happen. That might have been Dalton Schultz first. So a minute 38, how much can he milk per, per play? 40 or is it 30? Is it different than Ultimate Team? I guess I am supposed to onside kick this. Oh, is the game really over already? That would suck. Ooh. You know what's funny? That was kind of like a... Oh! What the fuck? I've been playing Madden for... I've been playing Madden for like six years. I don't think I've ever, literally ever... I don't think I've ever gotten onside kick! <laughs> oh my fucking god! First and ten? Lamar goes down to Vita Vea. I'm not gonna... I don't have to hurry up. I don't have to freak out. That did burn a lot of clock, though. I don't like how much that burned right there. Third and 13, darn it. I thought Dalton Schultz would have that for sure. Honestly, I don't really deserve the W, so if I don't get this, that's just karma. I don't know if this has ever happened to me before. I don't think I've ever been in this situation. The scriptwriter strike is over, boys. The scriptwriter strike is fucking over. And if you don't believe that, then you didn't watch this game with me. All right, third and 13. I think I got him. Nope. Fourth and 13. Gotta go for everything right here. Fourth and 13. I got him. That was too easy. I'm gonna call a timeout right now. So, <sighs> field goal just puts me in OT though. Another fucking overtime game. Oh my God. The script is magical, man. All we had to, all that we had to connect was one pass. That wasn't too bad. Najee, waiting for Najee, waiting for Najee. He actually got positive yards on that. He got four yards on that. God, I'm just tempted to fucking airmail something. But this has been such a good game. If I do something stupid, I'm going to be so frustrated with myself. I'm double teaming far right. I'm going to try and roll out here. I have the timeout. I want the win. He's better than me. I just got fucking... Like, that onside kick was insane. I want to score. I don't think I can beat him if I don't, like, insta-score. You know what I mean? First and 10. I'm going to hit him with something I don't think he's expecting. Yep. <laughs> no timeouts left. On the 21! Ah! No timeouts left. On the 21. 27 seconds. I'm going for... I'm not fucking kicking no field goal. I'm going for it, man. I don't deserve to... No, I'm going for it. 100%. I'm going full tilt for this. I think he's in Tampa too. Oh, you have to get out of bounds, Najee. 21 seconds to 13. He's leaving the underneath? Well, I, he was in cover three clouds, so he's supposed to have a light blue down there, but I guess he did not feel like stepping up. I just have to keep doing exactly what I'm doing is what I need to do. I, I'm going I'm going for fucking everything right now. Wow, Bryce Hall clamped it. Gee jeez. Oh, what a good game. Damn it! Bryce Hall! Bryce Hall just locked my ass up. What would the uh, what would the safety do for me here? Anything? Not really. Darn it. Dude, I saw Debo coverage and I saw Debo Samuel in single coverage and I was like, bro, that's how I win the game right here. That's how I win the game. Damn. Fucking Bryce Hall. Dude, I got clamped by a TikToker on the final play. Yo, GG's to GG's the goo. That was one of the best games, bro. That was one of the best games. Bro, look at you guys. You guys are so sad. Look at you, chat. Man, you guys get blessed with amazing. You guys get blessed with amazing games. 90, 90% of the time. What do you guys want me to win every game? Single coverage. I got a 90 overall X-Factor receiver on a 78 overall rookie.
I'm throwing that every time. You guys are babies. What? What is it? What is it? Win the game or it's not a good game? Go fuck yourselves. You guys suck. I'm like, I gotta go build a new community. Well, win the game or it's a bad... That was fucking sick. That was an awesome game. All right, well, let's watch it back. Let's watch it back. Let's see just how bad it was. So, I saw single coverage. Well, Najee would have been a good throw. Look at Najee coming out the backfield, because I think who's usered on Najee is the... Is his user. So, if I throw Najee right here, he might go into the end zone. But, dude, come on. Dude, come on. I see him. He's lined up inside of Debo to start, too. But Bryce Hall just, what a good play. Oh, darn it. All right, well, let's look at the stats. Um, Look at, dude, Dak threw such a good game. No interceptions, 13 for 14. Honestly, the really the only unlucky thing that happened to us that whole game was the bobbled interception fumble, or bobbles interception field goal. But once I recovered the onside kick, then I, I, I the luck was all on my side. Uh, Najee, six for 49 and two touchdowns on the ground. And then one in the air for Dalton Schultz. So that's a fire game. So week 14 in the books, we take our first user controlled loss. So that sucks. We now move to eight and five, but the good news is there's no breakouts on the line. There's no media days on the line. So we just took a tough L and it's part of the process. That's a tough one, boys. All right, boys. Week 14, a great game, a tough loss. Let's just get ready for the next one.